then, um, we are back, um, in Roblox Puppets, so, hold on. Alright, so I honestly don't even need to explain what even Roblox Puppet is. I'll just explain it. So first, let me tell you about the history of this Roblox game, alright? So, here we go. Now, we already, already know about Roblox Piggy and stuff, you know? I actually don't need to explain it. Roblox Piggy and stuff. Everyone knows about Roblox Piggy and stuff. It especially got popular during like COVID and stuff. You know, twenty the twenty twenty era. We all had our twenty twenty era. Be honest, honestly, you know. Um, yeah, we had those animation memes and stuff. You know, like, um, yeah, we made those ship videos and shit like that. Um, but yeah, Roblox Piggy was a pr like was one of the fastest growing horror games on Roblox like during that time and stuff. You know, especially you know since everyone was stuck inside during COVID and stuff, that even had, that even had the more time for, like, the, the people to actually, you know, play Roblox Piggy and stuff, and especially got popular when YouTubers like Flamingo, like Dennis, like Sketch, even, like, played it and stuff like that, you know, and yeah, Roblox Piggy was, basically just became an icon in, on the platform and stuff, in the metaverse, as Roblox says, and of course, when it usually comes to popular games trending on Roblox, there's always at least some fan games about it, or like basically inspired games and stuff, you know. Um, and yeah, that's yeah, that's when the fan games come in. And I I don't think you know like if the fan games immediately came in and stuff. I'm pretty sure they like you know like they started like yeah. Ow. Yeah, Piggy fan games started to appear and stuff like around 20 like early ish, maybe like early or late 2021 and stuff. Yeah. Um, Piggy fan games and Piggy inspired games started basically, you know, kind of get popular around, you know, like the late 2020, like the middle of 2020 to like, you know, the early 2020 world. So somewhere around that time, I don't exactly really remember and stuff like that, but yeah. And yeah, probably one of the first, honestly, Piggy inspired games to actually come out was Roblox Puppet. Now, um, if you guys remember b way back into, way back in like, you know, my U YouTube like, you know, my YouTube channel and stuff, you know, around 2020 again and stuff, you know. Um, yeah, I played Roblox Puppet for the first time and stuff. And yeah, Roblox Puppet was created on April 5th, 2020, and was officially released on May 12th, 2020. I'm pretty sure that was like, yeah, I'm pretty sure that was like a few days before, you know, the final, like, chapter of book one came out on Roblox Piggy and stuff, you know. Um, so, yeah. So yeah, Roblox Puppet... Rolex Puppet Connie got some recognition, like, somewhere in there, but then, when, once, you know, Flamingo and Sketch played, you know, the game and stuff, you know, usually when it comes to Roblox YouTubers actually playing Roblox games and stuff, they're able to, like, make them, like, go popular, explode with popularity and stuff like that, and that's what happened with Roblox Puppet, once the popular YouTubers, um, played the game and stuff, um, the games exploded in popularity and stuff, you know, it's, like, it's probably, like, the top 10 most popular Piggy-inspired games, I might be wrong on that. I might be wrong on that. I did. I. I'm not really gonna, you know, compare the visits between all the Piggy inspired games. But it has to be like at least the top ten, right? Probably. But yeah, so far the game has almost 200 million views. Yeah, 200 million views. Usually nowadays with Piggy fan games and Piggy inspired games, they don't. They don't really get that much recognition nowadays because obviously Piggy died out and stuff. You know, like I, I hate to say it as a Piggy YouTuber myself nowadays. Um, Piggy has kind of died out, and so as, like, you know, Piggy Inspire games and fan games, like, still, like, Piggy fan games and Inspire games are still being created to this day and stuff, you know, but are not really getting as much as recognition, like, just like in, like, 2020 and stuff, you know, um, but yeah, so far the game has 200 million visits by, oh, almost 200 million visits by the time I'm recording this, so, yeah, you can say that Puppet got really popular in the Piggy community and stuff, you know, and probably even got a community of, of its own, maybe, maybe not. And yeah, if you always, if you always remember playing, you know, Roblox Puppet like the first time it, the first time it came out and stuff, you already know that it was basically you know Roblox Piggy, but it was Sesame Street and stuff. You know, like we ha like we have yeah we had like Elmo here, which was called Mo. We have Cookie Monster, which was called Cookie. And stuff. You 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 know the typical typical and stuff. You know, and yeah, this was basically just like you know like kind of yeah, this is basically like a Piggy. Yeah, it was basically just Piggy, but like you know Sesame Street, which. With, with all these characters being at least related to, you know, a Sesame Street character. Like, we had Mike, who was originally, you know, Oscar and stuff, you know. Um, yeah, we we had, you know, Quack and stuff, you know, Big Quack or something like that. Yeah, Quack, which was obviously, you know, um, Big Bird and stuff, you know. Um, 
Yeah, and yeah, basically just like Roblox Piggy, they were releasing, you know, chapters pretty quick and stuff, you know. I'm pretty sure they released like two of the chapters and something like chapter two and three, both in the same month and stuff, you know. Um, and I'm pretty sure chapter four in like somewhere around June, maybe, like May, I, I, I don't know, but yeah, and like, yeah, chapter five was like in... I, I honestly I don't really fucking know, but yeah, because they were releasing the chapters very quickly and stuff, you know, just like Roblox Piggy, like they were able to get still get like you know multiple players in the game and stuff, you know, and yeah, like Roblox Puppet was was probably gonna become like one, like the top ten most popular like you know Piggy inspired games to ever exist on Roblox, until it got too popular and stuff, you know, um, because like during around the summertime in, of 2020, that's when boom. Roblox, Roblox Puppet was taken down, and it was basically privated and stuff, you know, and everyone was so confused and stuff, like, what the hell happened to Roblox Puppet and stuff, like, who could have possibly done this and stuff, you know, and, and you, know, you know, stuff like that, and then I'm pretty sure it was confirmed, like, a few months later and stuff, you know, by one of the developers of the game, that Roblox Puppet was taken down because of copyright, you know, because obviously they were using Sesame Street characters, like, Elmo, Cookie Monster, like, you know, Big Bird and stuff, you know, um, they were using copyrighted characters, so obviously, you know, um, yeah, yeah, who owns Sesame Street? Um, does Disney own Sesame I don't fucking know, hold on. Who owns Sesame Street? Alright, so it seems that they're, like, the characters are owned by SW. I don't know who the hell SW is, exactly. Uh, oh, Sesame Workshop. Yeah, yeah, but obviously, so yeah, since they were using copyrighted characters of Sesame Street and stuff, you know, obviously the, the copyrighted owners did not like that and stuff, you know, obviously, and basically took down the entire Roblox game and stuff, you know, and yeah, the, yeah, the developers did, the developer did say that they were like, you know, completely re reworking the game and stuff, you know, like giving them, like giving new characters and stuff, you know, uh, yeah, basically, yeah, basically just changing up the characters so that they're not like, you know, Sesame Street characters, obviously, and, yeah, and ever since that, we never exactly heard from, you know, the... Yeah, we never exactly heard from the developers again and stuff, you know? We never exactly heard, like, you know, what, what, like, wh when the new rework of Roblox Puppet was gonna come out and stuff, you know? So, yeah, about one year later, like, when Roblox Puppet was taken down, it was, it finally came back up, and everyone was obviously very excited and stuff, you know? Lots of players came back to Roblox Pu Puppet and stuff. And they saw this and stuff, you know? They saw new characters like Milo, and we have Mint. And yeah, basically, you know, all the characters got changed up and stuff, you know, for copyright. And, you know, to avoid any further copyright from, you know, Sesame Street and stuff, you know? Stuff like that. Um, and yeah, like, everything was completely changed and stuff. Like, things from, like, the Elmo pictures and stuff, you know? Um, yeah, yeah, everything related to the Sesame Street was just completely gone. Like, just completely gone straight, straight up and stuff, you know? Yeah, and yeah, a little later after, you know, Roblox Puppet, um, they started releasing chapters again, you know, like Chapter 6, Hospital, Chapter 7, The Farm, and Chapter 8, Stitch Fill, so, yeah, we, yeah, it felt like Roblox Puppet was actually coming back and stuff, with its popularity and recognition and stuff, you know, and they, they could've, you know, um, yeah, and because they have, they had a new comeback, and because they had a new comeback after one year later, with like all three new chapters and stuff, you know, they even started releasing these season passes and stuff, you know, with, in which you have to get, gain XP from escaping and stuff, like shooting the bot and stuff, you know, unlocking like you know doors, um, to basically unlock skins and stuff, you know, um, you know, weapons, coins and stuff, you know, tr even traps, and yeah, it was it was a pretty interesting thing and stuff, you know, and yeah, they they just kept using overusing it and overusing it and overusing it and they basically just made multiple season passes and stuff a lot a lot more than even like chapters in general but then that's when um something yeah yeah something changed ever since some um, puppy chapter 8 stitch fail and stuff you know came out um, and that little quest with the guard Missy and, like, guard Fred, like, you know, like, gu like, the guard skins and stuff, you know, um, yeah, Henry the Dev and, like, the other developers of the game weren't really exactly focusing on, you know, chapters anymore and stuff, you know, the only thing that were they, fo that they were focusing on at this point was, um, you know, season passes and stuff, you know, like, they did a, like, they, like, here's the thing, you know, like, ever since, you know, 
like chapter yeah ever since chapter 8 came out in P roblox puppet which was like in like 2022 which i'm pretty sure but let me just go back to my video real quick on that um yeah basically like early 2022 and stuff you know yeah once that once the chapter finally came out like the fi finally came out that's when they weren't exactly making chapters anymore and stuff, you know? Because they were starting to, you know, make more um, season passes or survivor passes, as they, would, as they would like to call it. Instead of, you know, ch like actual chapters and stuff, you know, still continuing on the story. Which was kind of strange, honestly. I never exactly found out why they were making more survivor passes instead of chapters and stuff, you know? Because they still had a story to, to like, you know, like make, stuff like that, so... Yeah, and yeah, the last time, um, yeah, the last time they even made a Survivor Pass in the first place, what, yeah, let me just go back, yeah, so, the last time they even made a Survivor, um, Pass in Roblox Puppet was in Christmas of 2023, and that was this pass, the Survivor, like, the Christmas Survivor Pass of 2023 and stuff, you know, I still don't know if they actually, you know, made this skin look like Circus Baby on purpose, if, if they did, those are sneaky little bastards. But yeah, ever since that and stuff, you know, they didn't really update the game anymore and stuff, you know? Um, yeah, the only... Yeah, here's the thing, though. Here's the thing. Like, the only time... Yeah, I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm going to Henry the Devs, um, you know... Yeah, at, like, you know, Twitter. And yeah, the last time he even posted on his, um... On his TikTok, like, you know, Twitter account was in... March 15th, yeah, which was in, in March of 2024, which is obviously for the hunt event, which, yeah, in which he had, you know, the treasure hunt simulator game and stuff, you know, he had as well, and yeah, that was put into the hunt, so he was kind of busy with that, and yeah, ever since that, like, you know, they didn't really respond to anything, honestly, you know, and yeah, I, I, I even, like, yeah, see, like, worse chap Puppet Chapter 9, yeah, see, like, yeah, see, see, like, like other people are saying start updating the game again, um... Anything else? Nope. Okay, but, yeah, like, ever since, like, they, ever since they announced, like, you know, they were in the hunt event and stuff, you know, they just never, they, they, just, they just never said anything else. That was it, you know? Like, no more updates for Roblox Puppet, they even forgot to remove the Survivor Pass. Something definitely feels up, honestly. Like, they, something definitely feels up. So, yeah, the last time they even released a Roblox, like, a Puppet chapter and stuff was in 2022 that's that that's like yeah that has been like three yeah okay that has been like two years ago now by now you know but uh, yeah that was like ar around the er early like 2022 so let so it has been two years since we had gotten a chapter in roblox puppet and the last time we even got a survivor pass or and went the last time like puppet even updated in general was in was it was around Christmas time of 2023 that was seven months ago by the time I'm recording this so you probably might be asking the same same thing what the hell happened to Roblox puppet and this is honestly another case in which I don't even goddamn know you know you know I kind of researched it a little bit you know I checked you know Henry's of socials and stuff you know like Roblox and it seems that he really hasn't any really hasn't, you know, been, la like, like, last seen, or something like that, you know, um, I honestly don't exactly know what the hell happened to Henry and, like, the developers and stuff, you know, I even joined their Discord server, for God's sakes, and stuff, you know, and, like, I even check, check at it from time to time, and honestly, that yeah, they don't even, yeah, they don't, yeah, they don't even exactly, you know, like, make, like, it, yeah, it's kind of strange, honestly, like, yeah, all of the, all, like, all of their servers and stuff are, like, you know, controlled by, like, some AI bot or something like that, I'm pretty sure, you know? Like, like, it's honestly, like, it, it might not be a big deal, but it's honestly kind of strange if you really think about it, you know? Like, like, ever since Roblox Puppet hasn't been updated, like, you know, the developers kind of went silent for a while, you know? Like, it's kind of fucking strange. So yeah, if if you guys find found any, if you guys kind of research on this as well and kind of found found some clues or something or co what could possibly happen to developers or something like that, like the, like uh, once again, I don't exactly know what the hell happened to Puppet honestly. You know, like did they just didn't have any passion on the game anymore and then basically just didn't announce it? Did one of the developers die? 
I don't know. I don't. I don't exactly know what could possibly hap What could have possibly happened behind the scenes and stuff of this game? You know, it's very. It's very concerning. So yeah, if any of you guys like researched this and stuff and found something pretty interesting that like, you possibly comment down below, you you can do so and stuff. You know, you could probably explain it more better than what I'm doing right now and stuff. You know, because um, yeah, t yeah, yeah. This ki this kind of, yeah this actually needs to be studied honestly. You know, like like the this appearance of you know Roblox puppet and like the developers and stuff like like kind of needs to be studied honestly. You know, like they haven't really been active for a while. You know. It's like Roy Stanford and stuff, you know? You know, the guy who made Spider and stuff, that Piggy and Spider game, and, like, Rainbow Friends and stuff, you know? Like, he makes, like, a popular... He, like, he, he like makes, a, like, a popular Roblox game and stuff. It gets extremely popular with, like, billions of visits. And then he just goes silent, and then next thing you know, he just makes another game and stuff. And then, yeah, the same cycle just continues on and stuff, you know? So, yeah. Once again, I don't exactly know what happened to Roblox Puppet and stuff, you know? So, yeah, it's kind, kind of strange, though. And once again, I'm obviously not one of those people, like, one of those, like, professionals and stuff, you know, who, like, easily, like, go through, like, their socials and stuff, find out, like, what they what they have been going through and, so, like, you know, stuff like, I'm not one of those professionals, so obviously I don't really know that much and stuff, you know, so, yeah, it's, it's still kind of strange and stuff, you know, like, they, they haven't released the chapter in two years, they haven't released the Survivor Pass almost a year ago, like, five months from now, it's gonna be a year ago since they even released the update in general and stuff, you know, so, yeah, and the only time they actually, you know, like, updated the game was, like, you know, remove, like, the entire Survivor Pass kind of thing and stuff, and just replace, yeah, it's pretty strange, and, yeah, the, here's the thing, like, the, the last time they even, like, you know, released anything related to, you know, like, kind of, like, you know, the gameplay of the game was the infected game mode and stuff, you know, which was obviously infected game mode and stuff, you know, and yeah, that was the last time they even released an update revolving around, you know, the gameplay of the game and stuff, you know, stuff like that. So, yeah, once again, I don't exactly know the entire history, what could have possibly happened, like, ever since Puppy Chapter 8 came out. I don't know if, like, there's been some arguments and stuff, or just, you know, like, the differences between, like, different, different choices and stuff, you know, between, you know, the developers. I don't exactly know. Um, but for now, we're just gonna have to wait. I don't know if, like, Chapter 9 takes a while and stuff, you know? Especially two years for a while. I don't exactly know. We're just... Just gonna have to see what could possibly happen to Roblox Puppet in the future. And yeah, because they haven't been, they haven't been updated for a while, obviously their player base kinda, you know, dropped. And I mean, dropped. Not, like, Niagara Falls and stuff, you know? Like, right now, by the time I'm recording this, this game has only, like, about, like, 200 players right now. And that's because this game hasn't really updated in a while and stuff, you know? It's pretty fucking sad, honestly. But yeah, since this is obviously... Yeah, so... Um, so since, like, um... Yeah, what I... Yeah, what I usually do in stuff in these kind of videos is I basically explain what could possibly happen to the Roblox game and stuff, you know? And then I basically revisit the Roblox game and stuff, you know? Um, so, you know... Yeah, so I revisit the Roblox game and stuff... And yeah, this has been a series I've been doing lately, and it seems that a lot of you guys really enjoy the series and stuff, so I will most likely do more on Roblox games that I did play, play before, but they never really, they basically just kind of disappeared off the face of Earth and stuff, you know, stuff like that, so. <clears throat> um, yeah, so, um, yeah, we're just gonna play Roblox Puppet a little bit and stuff, you know, kind of bring back memories a little bit, you know, since it's especially been a while since I even played a new chapter in Roblox Puppet and stuff. And here's the thing, you know, like, here, here's actually the thing, you know, because of Puppet's gameplay and stuff, you know, like, their gameplay like this and stuff, you know, yeah, be because of their different kind, yeah, because of their different kind of gameplay compared to other Roblox Piggy games and stuff, you know, they actually, they actually, you know, yeah, they basically, uh, made, yeah, hold on, yeah, because of Puppet's, um, different, like, game style, like, gameplay and stuff, you know, compared to the other Piggy fan games, the Piggy Inspired games released uh, in the same year and stuff, you know, um, like, it started, it, like, other people started to create in their own kind of inspired games, like, inspired by Puppet, not, like, actual Piggy, but, like, Puppet itself and stuff, you know, like, here we got Melody by Kachow Speed 95 and stuff, which was, which had the same kind of gameplay uh, as, you know, Roblox Puppet, and see, even says in the script right here, you know, Inspiration, Puppet, Piggy, The Barbs, and many more. Yeah, even, like, games like Digital Circus. Yeah, you can already tell this is basically, you know, Roblox Piggy, but instead it's just The Amazing Digital Circus, you know? So, um, 
yeah, like, yeah, it has the same kind of gameplay as well and stuff. Like, it even has, you know, the thumbnails where it, like, ha shows the chapters and stuff, you know, and even, like, the, like, the bot itself, you know, like, you know. Um, yeah, even, like, this game called Tom and Jerry. Huh. I wonder what happened to it. Yeah, we even got, we even got Jeffy and stuff, you know, which obviously it's basically just SML and stuff, you know, so, um, yeah, we've, yeah, th th I'm pretty sure this was called the Lazies, which was basically like Lazy Town and stuff, but I, but it got taken down, I don't exactly know the reason why for this one, um, probably got some backlash, I don't, I don't really know, but, um, yeah, we even got some like the Barbies and stuff, which is basically just Barbie related and stuff, you know, what the fuck, what the hell's going on? Okay. Well then, um, yeah. So like, even other, yeah, even the bales and stuff, you know. Um, yeah, even yeah, inspired by the Barbs and Puppet. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? Yeah, yeah, bub like gum, you know. Yeah, yeah, like all of these, yeah, all of these um Roblox games and stuff. Yeah, like all of these pup like puppy inspired games are inspired by Roblox Puppet and stuff, you know. Um, because of like it's different gameplay compared to like the other like these other Roblox games, you know. Um, yeah, so yeah, um, not gonna lie, um, Roblox, yeah, not gonna lie, Puppet really did change Piggy and Spire games just a little bit, just a little bit, honestly, you know, because sure, Piggy and Spire games are still inspired by Piggy, but they're, but nowadays they're mostly inspired by Puppet, because obviously they're different kind of gameplay and stuff, you know, um, and, and it seems that fucking Roblox, god fuck, alright, we were able to get back into the game and stuff, so yeah. Now we're gonna basically just revisit the game and stuff, you know, kind of play for a little bit, you know, get back some memories and nostalgia, you know. Um, yes, because obviously we haven't played it for a while because it never received many, many, any updates for quite a while, you know. Henry, I know you're goddamn watching this. I'm, I, we're still waiting for Chapter 9. No, like, no joke. Where the fuck is it, honestly, you know? I know you're still out there. I know you're still alive, you know. I mean, you, I, you probably, you know, you probably last visited a game, like, in, like, 2024 and stuff, you know? Like, and I probably didn't even see it, honestly, but, yeah, where the fuck have you been, huh? Come on. Like, make Chapter 9. We've been waiting for, like, two years. The, what the fuck? Mm. Anyways, so, yeah, um, let's just get back into Roblox Puppet. So, yeah, looks like they're, oh, and a killer's been stunned for 20 seconds. Oh, dear, we got Mike over here. Hello, Mike. Which used to be Oscar from Oscar, like, you know, Oscar, aka Oscar, uh, damn. 30 seconds. Um, okay. Yeah, yeah. Tw like, 30 seconds. Wow. They have been really using that, uh, you know, gun a lot, huh? Alright. Um, alright, well, yeah, we got the plank now. Yeah, so. I mean, at least, like, the puppet inspired games were able to, you know, still, you know, keep the puppet franchise kind of living at least you know because like i said before you know nowadays piggy inspired games are usually inspired by roblox puppet and stuff you know because once again we're their different kind of style of gameplay and stuff you know it's still it's still it's still it still has that kind of game yeah okay sorry yeah once again it still has that kind of gameplay of roblox piggy we have to find the keys and stuff like that you know but like the overall like kind of layout and like the, the it something just feels different about you know the yeah Something just feels different about, you know, the, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah, you, you probably even realize as well and stuff like that, you know, so, um, yeah, but, yeah, so, um, yeah, you know, like I even mentioned before, you know, we have, we have Piggy, we have, like, Piggy inspired games that are now, nowadays mostly just inspired by Puppet, and you made your way over here, shit, alright, yeah, nowadays we, nowadays, like, um, Piggy Inspire games are usually more inspired by Puppet and stuff, depend, like, usually on the game plan, like, the game plan stuff, you know, um, wow, you are a fucking idiot, um, anyways, <laughs> okay, he didn't like that, um, but yeah, you know, like, games like the Barbs, Melody and stuff, you know, which, which, which actually, you know, was, did, like, something kind of like, you know, Roblox Puppet, where they did have Hello Kitty characters and stuff, but obviously since, like, you know, the Hello Kitty characters were copyrighted, they obviously had to change up, you know, they obviously had to change up the characters and stuff, you know, um, to, like, like, make it their own characters, and I'm pretty, from what I'm, from what I saw, I'm pretty sure they didn't actually get copyrighted by Hello Kitty, like, the Hello Kitty, you know, company or something like that, for them to actually, you know, change the characters and stuff, you know, 
Um, they actually did it by choice because they probably already know what happened to Roblox Puppet and they didn't they didn't want to experience the same thing and stuff, you know. So, um, they obviously you know changed up the characters and stuff, you know, to avoid any copyright and stuff, you know. And yeah, because like recently they added this anniversary event where in which they actually brought back the old models and OG models of like the characters and stuff, you know. So obviously they did they they didn't get copyrighted and stuff, you know. They just you know. They, they just kind of changed up the characters by choice, obviously, you know, because, once again, they didn't want to end up like Roblox Puppet and stuff, you know, so, yeah. Yeah, so that's a heartbeat system, but, anyways. Yeah. Yeah, you, yeah, the only thing that basically changed about Roblox Puppet, ever, like, ever since they, they, like, it reopened back up, was simply, um, was simply, you know, the, ch like, yeah, was simply, um, the chat, like, um, yeah, the only thing that basically changed up was... You know the characters and stuff, and the and the, any Elmo picture, any Elmo related picture got kind of removed from, you know, the house and stuff. You know, and yeah, just anything in general about Sesame Street, like you know, in this, in the game and stuff, was basically removed from cop for copyright and stuff. You know, so yeah, it was a pretty crazy, you know, event in pay in like you know the Piggy community and stuff. You know, so yeah, all right, yeah, all right, so um. Yeah, they opened this up, so... Um, I'm pretty sure they already know... No? Yeah, it has, like, grainy music and stuff, you know? Or just or it just sounds like grainy music and stuff like that, but... Alright, hello! Um, yeah. Okay, alright, we only have, like, five... Okay, then, um, yeah, we only have, like, five minutes left, so we gotta hurry this the hell up. So, yeah. X Xbox servers are down, again, even though Xbox, like, Microsoft is really a $3.3 trillion company from what I researched and stuff. And, yeah, all their servers are just being run on a fucking banana at this point, you know? Like, can, is it really that difficult to, you know, set, like, restart the servers and shit like that, you know? And yeah, I'm still able to play this game actually, you know, somehow. But yeah, uh, okay. All right, you're you're speeding. Okay, gas, gas, gas. Look at this. Um, all right. Well, yeah. Now we need the code. So, oh, and what'd you look at that? So, huzzah! You have the fucking code. All right. Uh, you don't do this shit. Come on. Are you fucking? No, mine, 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 mine. Ha! Fuck you, mine, mine. Ha ha! You all suck. Ha ha! Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. All right. Um. Anyways, yeah. So. Now that we got that, we'll just go over here. Oh, and of course we need the gasoline. The problem is, um, we don't exactly know where the green key is. Someone possibly put placed it down somewhere, and that means we don't exactly know where that location is. So we're kind of fucked at this point. So, mmm, mmm, you little, you little bitch. Okay, all right, all right. Is it there? Hold on. Just gonna quickly look. No, it's not. Alright, gotta go. Bye bye. Alright. Alright then. Alright. Yeah, so the only thing we need is the gasoline, which requires the green key because it doesn't in that little ward like cabin, whatever thing you, you got. Um yeah. Okay. Um that's not the that's not the green key. I'm fucking yawning so much. I mean no no shit. It's like almost like ten yeah, it's like nine thirty PM at night on G July eighteenth. I'm halfway done with fucking summer break. They, can't they just give us like like an extended like summer break at least, you know? Like if I become president one day, I swear to god that I'm going to yeah. Yeah. Okay, man. Um yeah, if I become president one day, I swear I swear on my life that I will I will make sure that I get I give, you know. Yeah, I will I will swear on my life that I will give, you know, you know, like, all schools, like, a six-month summer break, you know? Um, uh, or, I would go the easy way and basically just cancel school in, in general and stuff, you know? And basically just piss off parents and stuff, you know? Yeah, yeah, parents, the kids need their education. They, 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 need, they, they need to learn and, and no math. Okay, then what the fuck is the internet for, huh? What is Google for? What is YouTube for? What is Yahoo for, huh? Exactly. We can just solve all our problems from fucking web searches and stuff, you know? 
we don't really exactly need to go through 10 hours of suffering that's basically, you know, um, that's basically, you know, prison for 9 plus kids, um, to just to, like, learn stuff that we're not even gonna, like, you know, really use in the future exactly. Unless if you're, like, a construction worker with width and height, at least, you know, stuff like that, but, like, in general, it, there's no fucking point, like, and I mean, if it, if you would count math as well and stuff, you know, yeah, if you count math as well, you know, when it comes to, you know, like a fast food cashier and stuff, you know, you have to add up, like, the, the prices of, like, you know, the food, but you can obviously just, just solve that from, oh, okay, you can just obviously solve that from, um, the internet and stuff, you know, so, like, there's no exact point of school if we just have the fucking internet to find all of our problems and shit, you know? Yeah. As soon as I turn 30, 35 years old, I swear to God, I will, I will, I will try to become president and stuff, you know? And either cancel school, or just please the fucking parents, at least, and basically, you know, give, like, six months of summer break and six months of school, you know? Because, like, half and half, you know? See? We're, that That's equal now, you know? Shit like that. I was just yapping the entire time, huh? Alright, alright, sorry about that. Um, I, I'm just still pissed that, you know, like, it's all, like, it's already, like, I'm already halfway done with, like, my summer break and stuff, you know? Like, it's, like, it's, all, it's already almost the end of July. August starts in, like, you know, a week or something, you know? How? For the love of fucking God, how? Huh? How is that possible? I don't know myself. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Alright, I, I should stop blabbering at this point, um, anyways, uh, yeah, we obviously got the infected game mode and stuff, you know, the last time they even added, you know, an update revolving around, you know, the gameplay of the game and stuff, you know, stuff like that, so, yeah, um, I honestly don't, I honestly don't know when, when Roblox Puppet is even ever gonna up, update again, maybe the next time it updates, it's probably just gonna be another typical, um, survivor pass and stuff like that, so, yeah, I guess we're just gonna wait and see, so. Alright, uh, the library will be a good place to start. Yep, just a taxi, just out of nowhere. Here we are. I've got a bad feeling about this place. Oh yeah, I forgot about Teddy and stuff. Now we got the red keys, so yeah. Um, since I obviously haven't been haven't played Roblox Puppet in a while, I kind of forgot, you know, where all these locations of the keys go, you know, because obviously since Roblox Upda Puppet hasn't been updated for a while and shit like that, you know, like I can't remember jack shit about the game and its locations of the keys, you know. So yeah, maybe if they actually update the game, the maybe if they actually update the game more. Then maybe, just maybe, then, yeah, alright. Um, well, yeah, now we got the red book, so, we're just gonna have to, yeah. But I do remember that, like, we have to, like, find specific bookshelves and stuff, you know, to, like, put the book in, and then I'll basically, you know, like, give, like, and open up, like, a secret, oh, wait, alright. Yeah, basically open up a secret hallway and stuff, you know, that'll basically, you know, you have to use the red and stuff to, like, activate one of the switches and stuff like that, you know. Yeah, uh, okay, um, looks like they opened that up, did they actually use the hammer yet? No, they didn't, I should probably go use it myself, you know, let me be the hero of the story. I don't know why the hammer specifically isn't the one, you know. Alright, yeah, see, there we go, now we use the hammer, good, problem solved. Alright, but yeah, now, we're gonna go grab ourselves the book, and yeah. Yeah, we have to find these specific tables, you know. I'm pretty... Yep, that is the red book right there. Boom. See? That's like... What switch is that? Switch 2. Yeah, switch 2. And now we're going to have to find out where the switch goes. Pretty simple, right? Uh, oh, what's over that? She has the, the book. Which greats. Uh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Please do not go fucking upstairs. Do not start this. Come on. No, don't do this shit. Come on. Come on, hey, come on, whatever your name is, come on, get over here, come on, over here, hey, 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 
that are you, do are you literally just not looking behind you huh yo are you fucking serious dude come on over here right over here i am literally jumping behind you you know i'm probably gonna start a march uh, dude come on hey why are you what come on dude are you really fuck dude come on come on do not do this shit to me come on oh looks like someone fucking died but anyway yeah come on no do not fucking go in there Come on, yes, pick the key up. But it, the thing is, they always don't even, like, you know, pick up other keys and stuff when it comes to, like, you know, the item that we have to fucking use to actually escape and stuff, you know? They, they, I, it's like they know, like, it's like they literally know that, like, the item is need, needs to be used, and yet they don't fucking use it. Jack shit. Come on, dude, come on. Are you kidding me? Dude, do you just not see, are you blind? Are you actually de dead ass blind, dude? I don't know if I don't know if this person is just screaming behind the camera, like the screen and stuff, you know? Because I'm literally just chasing them at this point. Come on, dude. Are you don't fuck you then? How about that? Yeah, fuck you. Fine, just make us fail the fail the round at this point. I don't even care, honestly, you know. I mean, it's not like I already beat in the chapter. I, I'm I'm just revisiting it and stuff, you know. And you're kind of ruining the nostalgia moment for me. Yeah. Thank you so much, player. I usually say game, but it's a player instead. But and so far, I have not even seen um, you know, the. Oh, okay. Now I now I found you. I really said that. I really said that I wasn't even able to like find you anywhere. But now I found you and shit like that. See, like that's really the only one that we need, and yet that motherfucker. Oh. Never mind. Okay. This news article says that there have been several murders. These must be the puppets that are after you. Only one person was able to escape the attacks. Alfred M. He currently is in critical condition at the hospital. We need to talk to him. He might know who who's behind all of this. Quick question. Is Alfred M like an actual character in the I mean there is a like a puppet char like there is like a Muppets character called Alfred. But it looks like um the Yeah, it looks like um like Alfred M is just like a completely original character in this and stuff, you know, so yeah. Well um yeah. Um so what happened to Robux Puppet in general? Like after all of this? Once again, I don't know. Honestly, you know, like like Henry the Dev never really announced what what happened to Roblox Puppet or where he even he has he even been ever since you know they announced that Treasure Hunt Simulator was in the hunt and stuff. You know, like like he he just like he just completely like like fucking left. Honestly, you know, we don't know what what, what we don't know where he is now at this point. Also, you know, like he the last time he even updated Roblox Puppet in general. Was back in 2023 around Christmas time, yeah, and we're not feeling so jolly now because at this point, Roblox Puppet is just fucking dead at this point. I do, I don't know what's it like. I do I don't exactly know what actually happened to the son of a bitch. Why, why, why fucking now? But yeah, at this point, we're just gonna have to honestly wait. Yeah, we're just gonna have to wait to see what happened next. Honestly, you know. So, um, yeah, that's basically about it and stuff. This is, like, the second time, I'm pretty sure, like, the second or third time, um, of uh, w uh, one of these videos in which I don't exactly know what happened, like, to the disappearance of a popular Roblox game, so. Or just a Roblox game that I didn't play before, but they just fucking disappeared and stuff, you know, so. Yeah, that's basically about it and stuff, you know. If you have any other Roblox games and stuff that, ba that were basically, like, popular ones, but then kind of, you know, died off and, like, kind of disappeared and stuff, you know, and that's the reason that they're fall off. Um, or, like, and, like, yeah, maybe there's some Roblox teams that did play before and stuff that were got, that got popular and obviously, you know, kind of, kind of, you know, died out as well and stuff, you know. If you just have any ro other Roblox games and stuff, you know, that kind of died out and stuff, you know, and kind of, you know, have, like, a big follow-off and stuff, you know, that needs to be studied at this point, um, uh, then you can suggest, suggest them in the comments or just suggest them on the group wall. My Roblox group, the Puggy Bazooie group, by joining it. 
So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Puggy Buster YT is on right now, and I'll see you guys in the next video. As always, peace out.